We are off to our favorite restaurant of, of all time, right? Not just San Antonio. Yeah, he's nodding. Um, it's called Bohannon's. It's on Houston Street, uh, downtown San Antonio, across from beautiful, majestic theater. And I'd say we eat here twice a year, three times a year, sometimes. You eat here more than I do. You get to go on business, but I only get to personally eat here two or three times a year. And um, it's pretty much known for its steak, but what I love about Bohannon's is the ambiance, the service, the presentation. It's just, it's beautiful. I'm gonna try to sneak a little bit of filming in there. I will not be talking, because it's a really nice restaurant and people just, you know, do not want someone to whip their camera out and film. So I'll just do some like, no sound shots, but it's just gorgeous, so you're gonna have to, I'm gonna sneak some peeks in there. But anyway, we are on our way and we are one minute late past our reservation, so kind of in a hurry. So I'll see you inside. Sunday school, but before we do, oh yeah, pumpkin spice latte time. Hey, I just came back from grocery shopping. I put all my groceries away and I found a box from Merle Norman waiting on my front doorstep. I'm really excited. Merle Norman reached out to me and asked if I'd be interested in trying some of their new makeup. I think they're kind of rebranding themselves and it's an old name, it's a well-known name, and I've never tried any of their stuff before, but I've got to, I'm just gonna unbox it. I took off the address label, but you gotta see what UPS did to this box. Like, they just beat the you-know-what out of this. So I'm a little nervous about what's gonna be inside. Oh, there's a little note. That's so cool. We'll read that note later. Um, let's see what's inside. We've got anti-blemish foundation primer acne treatment gel. Ooh, that could be quite useful, especially during certain times of the month. Um, Wicked Lash Mascara, nice. You know I'm continuing to search for the perfect mascara. I'm just gonna start grabbing things here. Okay, this is a four-in-one color kit, color contour and highlighter. Huh, I'm gonna have to open that box. Um, this is a clear lip pencil. Ooh, I've been wanting to try one of those. Soft touch eye pencil in blackout. Can never go wrong with a good black meth, uh, eyeliner. This is, oh, CC cream. Broad spectrum SPF 30 in light ivory. That would be me. If you look up light ivory, it says C Marnie. Um, liquid, ooh, liquid lip color in social light. Look at that. Might have to try opening this up. I'm wearing Zoya Aubrey on my nails, in case you're wondering. Ooh, okay. That looks pretty wearable, so that's good. And this is another one in Drama Queen. I wonder if it's like a red or... Ooh, ooh, better than red. Oh, this is gonna be gorgeous for the fall. And then let's open this one. Obviously there will be a video on all of this if i don't break it all first easy to open one-handed that's it oh this is interesting okay so it's like a very shimmery this must be oh it's so soft that's the oh i barely touched it that's very impressive this must be one sheet color very nice actually like way more wearable than it appears in a container this must be another cheek color. Oh, these are both very soft. And then the bronzer, I'm barely touching it. Oh yeah, it's very light. So um, I'm gonna swatch that on my hand. You really can't see it. Can you see it? You really can't. So that was a waste of time. Okay, and then my note. So a very nice selection from Merle Norman. Thank you, Merle Norman. Hey everyone, um, it's Tuesday. I had to think about that. A lot going on this week. Um, I am with my husband in new temporary office space. That's part of why I've been so busy. Um, 
because he is moving offices and it's gonna be really cool when it's all done. But they have temporary office space and I just wanted to just show I wanted to show you the view because it's beautiful and highlights some of my favorite parts of San Antonio. The windows are need to be washed, so you'll see spots, but um, it's not me, it's the dirty windows. Anyway, so there we go. Right there is the brand new Tobin Center for the Performing Arts, and it is absolutely beautiful. It just opened this month, and we're very proud of it here in San Antonio. You can see there's the river right there, that larger building right there, that's the Hotel Indigo, which I'm very curious to see what it looks like on the inside. And then that littler building with the red roof is the uh, Havana, or Hotel Havana, I think it is, which is a really cool place, and it backs up to the river as well. And then over there, this is the big four, this is the Channel 4 WOAI Studios, which when I do San Antonio Living, it's done there. And then um, those treat the rivers right over there. Um, so it's a pretty neat little thing. And then if you look up way out there, I live somewhere in that direction, way far away. But it's really neat. You can see our synagogue from here. Um, let me zoom in as much as I can. Okay, I think we've maxed it. Whoop. So that, whoops, the dome, the red dome, that's our synagogue. It has a big red dome. Ooh, it's very shaky. I'm sorry. So that's pretty neat. But anyway. The city is actually prettier from the other direction, but getting to look at that all day is pretty cool, I have to say. There's some prettiness there. Good morning. It's Thursday. I don't know why I can't remember what day it is. When I, the minute I hit record, my mind just goes poof. It's not that early. In fact, it's late, and I'm being a slug, a sloth, a lazy bones. It's 9 o'clock in the morning. I am... Um, Makeup lists. I have not, I haven't even washed my face yet. I've done nothing. I washed my hair. I showered last night. This is what it looks like. Jammies. Very exciting. Um, I wanted to vlog yesterday. I intended a vlog um, during my son's football game and then our vet called with news about Bosley. That was not great. You'll have seen that video already. So I'm not going to get into it now. Um, just didn't really want to vlog at that point. But I think I hear him coming. Hey, dude. Oh, bad haircut. That's from the um, ultrasound we had to do. Well, I mean, we didn't have to, but we chose to. And um, speaking of haircuts, which one are you? That's Mimi. She got a haircut. And that's Wrigley. You got a haircut. And these lovely additions to our house, um, these lovely runners, they go all the way through and into our room. Bosley's having a hard time um, with motor skills, although you would know by looking at it. And um, hey, big guy, we love you. If you have to go outside, we're gonna have to stop because I don't trust you on the stairs. But um, anyway, you know we're doing what we can to make his life just easier. He's not in pain or anything, but uh, as of now, but um, he does have some traction issues and balance issues, so. We put runners kind of throughout his walking area so that he has a little easier time of it. And the Westies are enjoying it as well. So there you go. Anyway, it looks like he does want to go out. He just woke up from a nap. So um, next time you see me, maybe I will not look like I've just rolled out of bed, which is exactly what I've done. Although I have been up since 545, to be fair. So I'm just really tired. Bosley's not sleeping through the night, and I think it's his meds. And so... We have to get up and actually not just open the door and let him go, but escort him down the stairs or out into the front yard and make sure he's okay and then get him back into his bed. So it's like having a newborn and I'm tired, but that is okay. So we're going to go take him out right now. Right now. Let me see that face. Oh, I love you. I love you and your wagging tail. You're a good boy, Boz. You're a good boy. Okay. You're a good boy. You like the sunshine? Okay. But this is my favorite part. I know it is. Just remind me when I'm about to fall off the escalator. Okay. Get out. 
Okay. <laughs> Don't break it back. We're in the wrong shoes. I'm gonna end the vlog here. Um, we are going to be going to, guess what, a football game tonight. I'm gonna change. But um, I just got back not too long ago from taking my friend Katie to lunch for her 50th birthday. She's gonna kill me now. Um, we went to lunch at Neiman Marcus, which is like the best place to go for a birthday lunch or a special lunch because it's just one of those quintessential ladies who lunch kind of places. It's not somewhere you would go every day. It's a little pricey, but it's just elegant and pretty and very girly in there. So that was fun. And I just, I want you to see what I've been up to. I don't know what I'm doing. Like, what is, what is this? Stop. Um, I just filmed a video about, I've been trying, these. Merle Norman sent me a bunch of products, so I've been trying those out. And there is the big guy. <laughs> he's looks like he's been attacked with a, with a scalpel, not a scalpel. Um, he's been shaved, badly. He's actually doing great. He's sleeping very soundly right now. Um, he looks a little pink. He went outside this morning and he laid out in the sun and every time I tried to move him, he just gave me a look and kind of moaned at me like, woman, I'm sunbathing, leave me alone. So I'm worried he got a little sunburn now. Did you get sunburned? Hey, hey, sorry. He was just running around in the backyard. Yes, I said running, he's doing really well. We took him off that bad medicine and put him on new medicine and he's like a new guy, except he's sleeping pretty soundly. And there's, we took all the pillows off the couch so that Bosley would have enough room to get on there and be comfortable. And then, hello Riggles, that's not your bed. That's Bosley's bed, but somehow you have taken it over. I don't know where Mimi is. I can't remember who told me to try yoga mats um, for runners, but I've got one down and I'm trying to find my other yoga mat, so thanks for that suggestion. And anyway, I just wanna show you, so I got, we, I took Katie to lunch and then I wanted to get her something special for her birthday, and so, um, we ended up both getting um, something special, but um, so it's not my birthday, but I got her the Tom Ford lipstick. Um, I think hers was Pink Dusk, and after much swatching and trying on and deliberating, I got pink, what did I get? Do we know? Can we read it? I can't read that. It's uh, Indian Rose, which I, I'm not going to try opening one-handed because I really don't want to ruin this, so you'll see that in a future video. And I got um, the, I know I mentioned the Oscar Blonde, I got confused, that's not the famous dry shampoo, this is, the Oribe, Oribe. So um, it's always sold out whenever I go to Neiman Marcus and they just apparently got a new shipment because it was loaded. And I'm not gonna lie, it was expensive for a dry shampoo, but you know what? Gonna see how it goes, save it for special occasions. So that's that, it was like $42, yeah. And then they were very generous with the samples today because they're just very nice at the fragrance counter. And I got a sample of the, oh, it doesn't say here, but it's the Tobacco Vanilla. They gave me a pretty decent sized sample of the Velvet Orchid. Those are both, their perfumes. And then if you spent a certain amount of money, they're having a beauty event. Um, you got a big bag of goodies. And I let Katie have the big bag of goodies, but she did give me the Oribe, I can't say this, Oribe. Repair and Restore, I don't even know what this is. Shampoo and Conditioner. So, it has gold in it. Does it have gold? Look at that, it says Gold Lust. I don't know. I don't know what it is, but it'll be fun to take, like if I travel or something, that'd be fun to take with. So, anyway, um, yeah, that was very, I made out like Bandit. I know it was Katie's birthday a few days ago, but I did okay myself. So that was my haul. I'm sure you'll see all that um, later on. I'm not wearing this is um, Merle Norman lipstick, by the way. So, and Lorac Unzip Palette and Laura Mercier Flawless Fluid Foundation over the Merle Norman CC Cream, which both I like, both of those. And um, this is that necklace that I've been wanting for a long time and I love it. It's the Tanner Bar necklace, Tanner Bar, really. And these are new from Bobble Bar Snake Earrings, I think it's like Snake Links. Ooh, they're fun. I just picked those up myself. So anyway, that's, that's what's going on. And um, and Old Navy, I love it. Decked out, going to Neiman Marcus, what am I wearing? Old Navy shirt and Target jeans, because that's how we roll. And that's it, I, uh, I will see you in the next video, the next vlog. Hope y'all had a great week. I love doing this with you. Thanks for sticking with me and watching every week, and I'll see you next time. Bye. So then I forgot to mention the giveaway. 
So, this is your opportunity to win all the products that Merle Norman sent to me, your very own non-used, non-swatched products. So 